Will Bakewell, test and validation lead with Enios Britannia. You were out as usual on um, Chase 4 today. Um, really interesting day. Um, I'm sure there was lots of great data gathered. I wanted to talk a bit about your job though, if we could. Um, right when we first started this, we asked you about it, and I remember one of the things you said was it was your role to try and make sure the data that was gathered was as accurate and clean as, as possible. Well, what does that look like on a daily basis for you? Well, just kind of talk us through your day. So, so on a sailing day, it's very much about trying to run the tests uh, in a manner that's as sort of methodical and scientific as possible, and then trying to uh, trying to make sure that it's annotated and uh, described well for everyone uh, sort of back here analysing, back in the factory analysing to, um, to, to do their work. Foil testing and we talk about foil testing, we talk about data gathering. Are they one and the same or, or are they two different things? I'd say they're one and the same. Um, I mean Obviously, there are some things that are far more subjective that we have to rely on the sailors to give us the feedback on, um, and there's other things which the sailors absolutely can't give us feedback on, and we can only measure. Um, so, so it's yeah, it, it totally depends what what we're what we're trying to look at. What. So, from your point of view, can you explain in simple terms how do you test a foil? What what are you looking for, and how, how do you do that? Oh, there's you know, it it totally depends what aspect of the foil we're we're trying to look at. Um, there's obviously parts of the foil that we, or parts of the performance of the foil that we really care about and think will be, you know, of, of, of key importance next year. Um, and we design tests just to go and look at the smallest possible bit of uh, the performance envelope that we really care about. You know, if we, if we have too many variables, it, it starts to get, all get a bit complicated. There's a device on the boat on the starboard side, just, just at the back edge of the foredeck. We believe it's LiDAR. Can you tell us if I'm right and what are you guys using that for? We've seen it with some other teams as well. We have seen it with some other teams, so it turns out we are all using roughly similar sensors. Um, and, and that's those sensors are looking up and telling us as much about the sails as we can see. Is that data that's gathered for analysis or is that live data that the sailors can use while they're sailing? Can't tell me? No, I'm not going to tell you. Sorry. Okay, no, that's fair enough. Um, now, let's talk about the foils a little bit. Uh, why did you guys test the uh, new banana foil against the, a T foil rather than the W foil? It's it's actually just trying to look at a, a sort of solid, consistent baseline. So we've all, you know, that's that's the foil that we've had on the longest. It just provides us an opportunity to, you know, compare against a baseline and learn as much as we can. Fantastic. We bounced around a lot. Thanks for being patient with me. <laughs> no worries. Thank you. Thanks.